Hello, this is Blue Star, Defender of Equestria. This is my next blind reaction video, episode 19 of season 8. Yo! Uh, what's that? I can't quite hear you. My noise canceling headphones are on. Is Pinky gone yet? Okay, good. I can take these off now. <laughs> oh, the sonic torture, but at least Pinkie Pie is happy, so yay! Wasn't my favorite episode, but I did definitely like that sentiment. And hopefully now that we're done with the sonic torture, that maybe we might have we have a good song this episode. Yes! In five, four, three, two, one. Ooh. I Trixie know, baby? Folks. She's been in Ooh, there Cadence. a long time. <gasps> no! Do you suppose the terrifying trunk escape is too much for her? No! What that would be sad. Powerful Trixie can't <laughs> oh. escape. Oh. Yay! But if you're there. Who's that? Who's Stand in again. here? Why our volunteer, of course. <gasps> Crab apple surprise! <laughs> <laughs> Was it very nice? Yeah. <laughs> well. <laughs> Yay! Trixie, that was an amazing show. Flurry Heart and I loved it. Aww. I'm so glad we decided to come. Oh, good. You two have a real chemistry. The terrifying Aww. trunk escape does require a great <laughs> and powerful assistant. Yes, it does. The way you two work together, it's like you've known each other as long as Twilight and I have. Oh. It was pretty fun. Eh. Of course it was. Here you go. There's nothing better than a bond with another pony. You can Aww. share all kinds of things. Sunshine, sunshine, <laughs> sunshine <laughs> It's like we're getting out of here. Do a little shake. <laughs> what? Did they want us to do that? I think we'll stick to the stage magic for now. Yeah. The great and powerful Trixie doesn't chant. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> my little pony, my little pony. My little pony. I used to wonder what friendship could be. Until you all shared it with me. Big adventure. Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. Oh, <laughs> hmm. it's another one of these. It's like, oh, well, that was kind of nice, but it doesn't really uh, tell us very much. It's like it doesn't seem. There's nothing like. Oh my gosh, we're all doomed. Which isn't necessarily a isn't which is not necessarily a bad thing, but it's like, well, it was a nice magic show. <laughs> Although it was kind of mean for them to lock the uh, <laughs> the volunteer in the trunk. That wasn't very nice, but oh well. It's it's a magic show. It's kind of goes with the territory. <laughs> There's parts of me were thinking it's like oh you were it's like Ray Smith you were willing to be put into this uh, tank and almost be drowned, but you're you're upset about being locked in a trunk. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> but anyway, anyway, it's like I must have been. I really took note of that stallion. It's like he is such a different design. It's just interesting. It's like ooh, I, I wonder is this. Is this just a coincidence or something? I don't know. Hmm. Maybe we'll see more about this. But anyway, um, it's like, ooh, Cadence and Flurry Heart. Oh, it's so nice of there. It's nice that they finally getting out to, to get out some more. So yo, I think that's great. It's like, um, it is nice to see some bonding between Trixie and um, Starlight Glimmer, and just everybody's having fun, and getting along. It's great. Yay. But, uh, yeah, it's like, I don't know if this is <laughs> this is gonna go anywhere during this episode or not, but we shall uh, see, I guess. But, um, yeah, it's like, uh, I don't know. It's like, again, waiting for the show to come back on. It's only been the first, like, minute and 30 seconds, so there's not much to talk about yet. <laughs> but, uh, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. So, and I'm hoping the show will be back on in, like, 10 seconds or so. So, mm. But, uh, so far, I guess the season has been okay. Not spectacular, but okay. Again, there's a lot of things that are changing and, and everything, and it's gonna be a while, I guess. But we shall see, because we're back. Yo! Do, 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 do. 
As much as I love my one pony show, it's always <laughs> nice to come to Ponyville and perform with my great and powerful assistant. Yay! This is right. We do work well together. Yes, they Doing do. Doing a show with you is almost as much fun as counseling students at Twilight School. <laughs> Road to friendship. What are supposed to be doing right now? Oh, oh, bye. See you later. See you later. Oh, bye. See you. <laughs> eh, ponies do come and go around here. Excuse me, Miss Powerful. <laughs> Hello there. Usually ponies just call me Trixie. Hmm. But Ms. Powerful uh -oh. has a nice ring. From here to Saddle Arabia, I have seen nothing that compares with your wondrous show. Would you consider blessing my homeland with it? I oh. was just about to set out on tour. <laughs> but Saddle really Arabia heavy. is much farther than my usual route. Stop. Oh, woo. Oh dear. <laughs> and uh, my caravan might not be suited for an extended tour. Hmm. Mine is new and quite spacious. If it would help mm. persuade you, I would happily trade it for yours. Really? Trade it? What? Heavens, no. No way. This is more than just some great and powerful wagon you see before you. Mm. It is shelter. It is transportation. It is my only friend on the long and lonely Aww. nights on the road. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> then I must see as many of your performances as I can. If I cannot convince you to bring your tour to Saddle Arabia, Aww. I must be prepared to relate its magnificence to your many fans there. Many oh. fans? Wait, fans? Ooh. <laughs> well, I suppose I could consider the trip. Wonderful! Oh, good! I look forward to seeing you on the road. And if you change your mind about the caravans, my offer remains open. Hmm, that was certainly generous. Mm. Oh dear. It's just so far away. Yes, it is. Of course, I love visiting new and exciting places. Mm. I am a traveling magician, after all. Good point. Hmm. Hmm. Sounds like your mind's made up. <laughs> Not quite. The road is a lonely place, and this trip even more so. Yep. I was hoping I might convince my great and powerful uh -oh. assistant <laughs> to come along. Please. Really? Well. Of course. You're not just my assistant and my counselor. You're also my friend. And yes. what's better than a road trip with friends? Nothing. Uh, this will be the best magical road trip ever. There might be a slight problem, though. I should probably get some pony to cover my student counseling duties while we're gone. Okay, that may have solved that problem. <laughs> oh, Trixie, dear. are you A lot right? of ponies need counsel. One caravan for two all set. Oh, oh. you brought luggage. You brought luggage. <laughs> I mean, of course you brought luggage. <laughs> right. Yeah, I did everything two ponies need for the road oh, trip of their lives. Three 1,000 piece puzzles, one copy of Dragon Pit, the best board game in the history of ponies, my famous collection of campfire spices, and an inflatable raft. What? Did I forget what? something? Why? I can pop back to the castle and grab it. <laughs> oh no. It oh no. Isn't that. <sighs> oh. Yeah, maybe we don't need the raft. <laughs> we just needed a little great and powerful reorganization. Okay. Now, everything just uh, it's perfectly. Oh no. Uh, oh dear. Oh, who oh. Are kidding? My wagon is too small for us. I Bummer. understand if you're having second thoughts. <laughs> second thoughts? No way. I'm kidding. This wagon isn't small. It's uh, cozy. Yeah. And there's no such thing as too cozy. Really? Well, all right then. Okay. I guess it's time to hit the road. Okay. Uh, Ow. Uh, uh, if I can get out of here, that is. Oh, dear. Ooh. Nice save. Uh oh. <laughs> Just wondering okay. what those were. Maybe there is such a thing as too cozy. Okay. <gasps> Darn it. <laughs> Another commercial already? But we just got here. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Okay, interesting. It's like <laughs> For some reason it's like sure we'll we'll keep all the board games, but we'll leave the inflatable raft <laughs> Not that they were gonna need one anyway, I guess I mean <laughs> I, f I think was it Sad Saddle Arabia? I think it's across the ocean, so you never know it might come in handy <laughs> But I don't know but yeah, it's like, hmm. I mean, I was, I mean, I'm, I'm glad that that guy wasn't just like, oh, a one-off character or something. I mean, I was thinking, oh, maybe this was just the, the artistic people getting creative or, oh, it's, oh we started another contest or something. 
<laughs> but, uh, ooh, no, I'm glad this is uh, actually a real character and stuff. It's like, that was really generous of him. It's like, I'll be glad to trade you my caravan. Really? That was really generous of you. <laughs> it's like, why, why would you do that? That's like trading somebody your, that's like trading your car for somebody else's car. It's like, wow. But I guess he just really, really, really wants them to perform in Saddle Arabia. So I guess that's, that's kind of cool, I guess. But yeah. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Mm. But, uh... <laughs> Yeah, I thought, yeah, unfortunately, I was like, I think he's like, what? You go on a long road trip? It's like, that's that's great, but what about all your responsibilities here and stuff? It's like, ooh. oh yeah, we'll just have to get somebody else to cover for for. Oh, okay, problem solved. Because <laughs> it's definitely a major problem that the main six now have. That yeah, they're running a school. They have all these other <laughs> responsibilities. Like they, most of them have like a day job, so it's like they can't just be like, oh, let's go on a long road trip. Oh no, I, I gotta do, I gotta, oh, I gotta worry about my canceling duties, and oh, my day job, and oh, yeah, right, mm. <laughs> So, yeah, so, I, for some reason, I kind of identify with that, because, yeah, it's like, can't just be like, oh, let's just go on vacation somewhere, it's like, nah, it's like, I gotta, you know, <laughs> it's like, no, we got big projects at work and stuff, I gotta think that through a little bit more, I guess, I don't know, but yeah. <laughs> it's like, really, another, another commercial already? It just feels so soon <laughs> but oh well um uh, running out of things to say hoping the show comes back soon <laughs> and i'm gonna stop now because i can't sing <laughs> or at least not sing well anyway but uh yes 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 uh, it would be cool to actually go to saddle arabia and uh hmm and everything and um I know. I do like this problem that they have. It's a pretty common problem. It's like, oh, we got all this cool stuff that we want to bring, or oh, we want to go on a road trip. Oh no, the, the vehicle is too small. What do we do? It's like, it's fine for just Trixie, but when... Oh, but now that we're going to bring Starlight Glimmer along... Oh, it's a little cramped now. Ooh, we have to sleep on top of the cannons and the, the smoke bombs and everything, so be careful. <laughs> anyway, we're back, so... Yes! Uh sure you wouldn't rather ride? Yes. I'm <laughs> sure. And you're not backing out. The two of us sleeping in that cozy caravan could get tricky. Mm. Trixie, there's plenty of high quality inns to stay out on the way. Don't okay. worry about it. Okay. I'm not backing out of the greatest and most powerful road trip bonding experience two ponies could ever have. Yay! Well, when you put it like that, I'm actually kind of excited. Mm. Me too! Hey. Thank goodness we're not like Twilight or the others. They probably sing a song about it. Oh, yay! A song. <laughs> Who's playing that music? We're off on a road to friendship. Our ride might be tiny and small. It's walking, no way, Trick. I am walking. <laughs> road trips are a great way we've been told to get along. I'm glad we're sticking to it. We've already got a song. We're off on the road to friendship. Oh dear. Side by side, just like he's in a bar. Uh oh. Pull the eject lever. Stronger than this tour's demands. My offer to trade caravan still stands. Wait, what did he say? Oh, they'll be different the raft. <laughs> Aww. Nice traveling with you, buddy. You too, buddy. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Man, this place is dangerous. On the road to friendship. Yes, we are. We need you up the Oh my gosh. <laughs> Any trip can be exhausting if you make a fuss. Yeah. But we get on so well. Come on. There's no way that could be us. Oh dear. <laughs> Uh, I hope so. <laughs> okay. Whoa! Yay, they made it! <laughs> oh, the I guess marketplace. They, they Perfect. I've learned the hard way. 
that life on the road requires very specific supplies, mm. and we only have so many bits, so we'll have to spend them wisely. Nice going, Starlight Glimmer. Mm. Sorry about wasting bits on street food. Oh, it's fine. Falafel bonding, right? <laughs> Besides, we still have enough for hay cakes and juice. What? Darn um, it. Why don't we go there? Oh, no, no, no. I always buy my hay cakes here. So we're just going to wait in line for hours, and, uh, which is totally yeah, which cool. Is totally fine. <laughs> waiting in line bonding, right? <sighs> After our falafel purchase, we weren't able to get everything on my list, but Bummer. we are definitely set for breakfast. And I'm sure we'll find out that waiting in that super long line was worth it. A few hiccups always happen. We'll be back on the road to friendship after a good night's sleep. Roll full. <gasps> oh, darn it. I'm sure we'll find something. No. Nope. Ow. Sorry. Hey, 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 no. Full. Rat. <laughs> ah, the Glow Pass Festival. Some nebula is no doubt filled to the brim. Mm. Luckily, travelers such as ourselves have our caravans. Yes. <laughs> you said there'd be plenty of places to stay. Don't even worry about it, you said. You uh, might have thought to make a reservation. Um, oh I've been with you singing and standing in line. When would I have done that? <laughs> I don't know. But I'm starting to think uh -oh. you aren't as great and powerful an assistant as I thought. Oh, dear. So you just brought me along to do your legwork? Ouch. <sighs> Oh, no. no, of course not. Okay, good. I'm sorry. I'm Aww. just frustrated. I was really looking forward to a relaxing night in a nice room. Oh, me too. Oh, but well. since there's literally no room at the inns, I guess mm. it's lucky we've got the wagon. Sleeping in tight quarters bonding. Oh. Yay. Yay, it's so much fun. <laughs> Ow. Ouchies. <laughs> Is there something I can do to make things more comfortable for you? Ow. You could get rid of this junk. Uh-oh. Yes. Well, before we throw away the magical items it's taken me years to collect, hmm. we could try switching hammocks. Fine. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Starlight. Oh no. Starlight. Starlight, there's I a monster there's outside. A wild animal outside. Oh no. <laughs> Starlight. Starlight. Uh, Starlight. <laughs> what? 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 I'm sorry. Your snoring is a bit um loud. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I do that. Darn I had it. my village convinced we were being attacked by bears every night. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I am not uh, abused. But we probably need a better solution here. Hmm. Uh oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Great and powerful. You rehearsing in your sleep again? Seriously? Prepare to be made. Are you going to go the? Well, <laughs> this is going great. Sleep well. Sure did. Uh oh. Is uh, that the last of the hay cakes? Yes. Oh, yeah. Sorry. It's fine. I don't suppose there's you know, more juice. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll have to resupply. Again. What a glorious morning! <laughs> Nice hair. <laughs> I can tell you how much I am looking forward to the first show of your tour. Is he going to be following us for the whole time? Probably. I do not know. <laughs> She's been in there a long time. Do you suppose the terrifying trunk escape is too much for a pony who drinks all the juice and talks nonstop in her sleep? I have no what idea what you're talking about. And powerful Trixie can What's... sleep. Because her oh. roommate snores like an Ursa major. <laughs> but if you're what's, there, uh, what's up with these two? Uh. Um. Hello. There's not much room in here. At least you don't have to sleep in it with another Ow. pony. Hey, let me out. <laughs> uh. 
This well. show was much better in Ponyville. Oh, yeah, it was. Mm. Oh, would you like the last carrot? I know how fond you are of eating the last of things. Mm. Oh, no. It might make me thirsty, and we don't have anything to drink, so... Oh, this is making me sad. <laughs> the good news is... I'm so exhausted I could sleep through a stampede of wild boars. Oh dear. Which you'll be delighted to know is only slightly louder than your snoring. Ouch. Well, I'm looking forward to rehearsing the act with you all night. So diligent of you to go over it and over it in your sleep. Mm. Practice makes perfect. Not today it didn't. Well, I'm uh -oh. sorry you're so miserable. Really? Because if you wanted to make things more comfortable, you could always bear down a bit. Uh-oh. Well, since you're so concerned about space, you can have it all. I'll sleep under the stars where at least the wild animals will be quieter than you. Oh. Aww. Oh. I do not mean to interrupt, but it seems there is trouble on the road to friendship. Yeah, it is. <laughs> you think? <laughs> oh, the symbolism. <laughs> I guess. Where's my wagon? I traded it to that pony from Saddle Arabia for his. He even threw in a pair of robes. Well, that was real nice of that guy. What? How dare you trade my wagon? I mean, that was actually pretty rude and inconsiderate. Mm. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Uh. <laughs> Oh, this episode, all of a sudden, it makes me sad. It's a classic road trip story. <laughs> it's like, I almost think that the, um, those two ponies that were in, I'll call it the Fireland. It's like arguing with each other that the wheel burns up. It's like, could that have been foreshadowing? No! <laughs> oh, the writing! <laughs> I guess I don't know. <laughs> but it's like, mm. I mean, yeah, certainly. Uh, road trips are great, but yeah, things usually get wrong and tense and stuff. Things go wrong and get tense and stuff. As things go wrong, things get tense and stuff. So, <laughs> unfortunately, brain is definitely malfunctioning. It's like I know how I, I feel your pain. It's like I couldn't sleep in or, or just stayed up late and stuff. Mm. Yeah, it's like <laughs> it's just like rah, rah, rah. it's like yeah. I, mean, I guess because yeah, on road trips because there's nowhere for you to go. It's like you gotta live in this tiny little <laughs> wagon with all the stuff and everything and then it's like yeah mm. all of a sudden reminds me of a line from babylon 5 where it's like you want to know how someone really thinks you make them angry because that's all i can i like to add it's like well because at that point they drop all their shields and their politeness and it's just like you know you're just there's just too much stuff in here <laughs> yeah it goes from it's cozy to there's just too much darn stuff in here and you're driving me crazy <laughs> So, yeah, it's like, whoa. I'm almost detecting a trend throughout this season of, you know, problems of like, you know, French long standing friends having problems and issues and they have to work through them. Because, yeah, because it's totally true. Again, I've said this a lot is that, you know, every relationship takes work and it's not just like, okay, we're friends. Yay! That's it. It's like, no, it doesn't work that way. You're going to have arguments, disagreements, and you're going to, you know, like in this episode, you're going to find out about stuff about your friends that you may not necessarily like, especially when you're on a road trip or something like this, because, you know, it's like, again, you get, you really get up and close and personal with somebody and learn stuff about them that you probably didn't learn about, you, that you wouldn't have learned about them before. So, oh dear, oh dear. I do have to say, that was kind of a mean thing for Starlight Glimmer to do, because first of all, it's not her wagon to to, to trade away, and, you know, and this could be bad, I mean, and stuff, I mean, hmm, I'm almost starting to think, could there be a more sinister reason why? He's quite insistent, you know, hmm, but we shall find out, because we're back, yo-ho. You what? How could I you? The old worn out wagon that was too small for us for this nice new spacious one that we it's can huge. both enjoy. Look, <laughs> oh, you could do that. No pony, I just did it. <laughs> you have some well, nerve. Now we both have plenty of room and you didn't even have to give anything away. Except my wagon which I've had oh, for years. Contraire. I did give something away. I gave away my wagon and my best friend. 
What? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were better friends with that beat up old wagon than you are with me. Ouch. Well, it's easy when the wagon is a better friend. It would have never traded you away. Oh. That's ridiculous. Oh, it is <laughs> ridiculous. In fact, this whole tour is ridiculous. I don't even know why I invited you in the first place. Oh. Well, maybe I should just head home. I think that's a very good idea. And you can take this horrible giant caravan with you. Fine. Oh. Good. Oh, but it has all the stuff in it. Oh, <laughs> poor Trixie. Well, this isn't going to work. Oh, ow, ow. Poor girl. Huh? Hello there. Goodness. Oh, Miss Powerful. <laughs> yeah, but where is your assistant? Uh. <laughs> I had hoped providing you with a more comfortable means of conveyance would allow you to once more dazzle the crowds with mystifying feats of magic. Oh. Normally, that sort of flattery would suffice. But today, hmm. we must discuss your dishonest and unfair procurement of my wagon. What? I desired your wagon and provided one of equal or better value in return. It seems hmm. like a perfectly honest and fair trade to me. Yeah. Fortunately, it is more nuanced than that. I'm sure it is. Say what? I am eager to set out, if you'll excuse me. You will not take my wagon. I am dead. <laughs> Okay. I am willing to wait as long as you are. <laughs> we'll just see about that. Uh-oh, it's a standoff. <laughs> oh, no. You know, even if I was willing to reverse the trade, you don't have my caravan to offer in return. That's a good point. Details! <laughs> Details? Huh? Oh. Ow. Start it. Uh oh. No, don't do it, Star Like Limo. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh dear. A lot less threatening when there were two of us. Yeah. Oh, the fire the flames. Oh boy. Uh, this place is awful. How did I not see it before? <laughs> You're in the middle of a song. <laughs> Oh, good. Your song really inspired us. We Aww. decided we need to head off on the road to friendship, too. It sure beats the road to deliveries. <laughs> Sometimes traveling together is hard. You reminded us you can also make it fun. Oh, Thanks good. Bye. <laughs> I'm glad they're having fun. Steaming hot beverage. Thank you, no. <laughs> the middle of the desert. What Ugh. are you two doing? <laughs> Going Taking nowhere fast. By lying down. Not that you care, wagon trader aware. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm still not interested, despite your assistance, convenient appearance. <laughs> Trixie, I came back to apologize. I should never have traded away the wagon. Yeah. But it wasn't mine to trade. Yep. It belongs to my friend. Hmm. If you truly were friends, I suppose I'd be honor bound to reverse the trade. Okay, fine. We're friends. Best friends who share a deep bond, but weren't prepared for the emotional challenges of traveling. Happy? I'm still unconvinced. <laughs> Perhaps you could prove your friendship. Okay. How? Ow. So we could do our friendship chant. We have a friendship chant? All right. Right. Our world famous chant of friendship that <laughs> we do all the time because we're such great friends. Okay. Magic. <laughs> magic. Oh. Of a smoke. <laughs> One to wave your hooves and tell It's totally not going to work. Little <laughs> Ugh, there's smoke everywhere. That was the worst friendship chant I have ever heard. And you two were clearly making it up as you went. What? <laughs> yeah, he was too smart Only for that. Only true friends would be willing to act so ridiculous for one another. <laughs> back the wagon. Oh, good. Though I'd suggest heading back to Ponyville. I'm not sure Saddle Arabia is ready for this. That's fair. Hmm? I don't know what that means. 
I'm sorry your Saddle Arabian tour was ruined. Honestly, I don't think I could have stood one more second on the road. Mm. At a certain point, I don't even like traveling with myself. Uh oh, oh, oh. It is a lot harder than I thought. Still, I'm glad we tried. No. So we know not to do it again. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's made our friendship greater and more powerful than ever. Oh, good. Um, you know, there's actually plenty of room in here for one pony nap. Oh. Is the show over? Yeah, the show's uh, over. <laughs> it's like, that. don't mind me, I'm going back into my truck. <laughs> It's always like it's you are working people working so hard on the show. Poor guy, he's got a long walk home. Mm. <laughs> oh, no. Oh dear, oh dear. So that was um uh, Episode 19, because I forgot the name of this episode. It was a road trip episode. It ended in disaster, which seems to be a trend for road trip episodes. <laughs> but again, something has to go wrong, because otherwise it'd be totally boring. <laughs> it's interesting that they decided, well, this was a disaster and we're not going to try it again. Hmm. That seems to be kind of a <laughs> un MLP thing to do. Just because you try something the first time and it doesn't work out doesn't mean that you should give up on that thing. I mean, it just means, oh, we gotta learn to do something differently. Well, if we try to do this again, well, we'll bring a bigger wagon or <laughs> or have separate wagons or something. <laughs> because I can't start sleeping in the same caravan as you. No! <laughs> That's a fair point and stuff, you know? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm kind of disappointed in that, but at the same time, if you know that, yeah, this isn't gonna work, then yeah, then you shouldn't try it. For some reason reminds me of one of my personal sayings, if you can't swim, don't go to pool parties. <laughs> yeah, if you know this is gonna end in disaster, then yeah, it's better to not put yourself in the situation to begin with. I definitely liked a song, yes! I thought you said you weren't gonna sing a song, but here you are singing a song. What gives? <laughs> it was a really nice song though, so yo! I was just thinking, you know, there hasn't been a lot of what I would call really memorable songs, like May the Best Pet Win and all that in a long time, but it's nice to see that there are some songs. I don't think, honestly, this one may go on that list of songs, but it is nice to have some, a few more songs and stuff once in a while. It is kind of a song where it's like, we're singing one thing, but something else is happening. It's like, we're, you know, saying how great this trip is while we're swinging over a pit of alligators and, and stuff, so... <laughs> and I'm glad those two delivery ponies were okay and they're actually making friends and they're actually having a good time. Yay! <laughs> I just hope those bags weren't filled with uh, mail when they were floating down the river because that would be unfortunate, but... <laughs> Overall, I think I like this episode. It's not my favorite, but um, I think it was pretty good. I mean, it always makes me sad to see such good friends arguing, but it definitely is a thing of that, you know what, they gotta work this out and everything. And I'm glad that the Saddle Arabian Pony was actually pretty key to this plot. And that it's nice to see the Saddle Arabian Ponies uh, again, because we haven't seen them in a while. And I thought that was good. I mean, and it was good that they were trying to, you know, expand their horizons and go to Saddle Arabia and all that, but it didn't work out. <laughs> and apparently Saddle Arabia isn't ready for them, so... <laughs> no, I guess. Nah. And it was nice to see Starlight Glimmer and Trixie bonding and actually be able to get away from the school and everything and try to go on a road trip. And even though it ended in horrible disaster, at least they learned something and hopefully, you know, got a little bit closer and stuff and everything. And um, I think it was a good episode, so I liked it. Yo! So I hope you enjoyed this video. And as always, thank you for commenting, liking, and subscribing. And until next time, this is Blue Star. Stay strong and pony on. Blue Star out.